Hello everyone, welcome to Pumpkin Horror. Now you see in this mask, it's most likely if you're a subscriber, you've come across this mask on one of the other uh, videos that I have on this channel. I decided to go ahead and redo it and do it by itself because it is in um, you know a bundle type of mask where I had some cheap masks and I showed this one along with it but not much detail is um, mentioned about it. I did some research on this particular mask and found out that the actual company that makes this mask is called Take One. It is located in China. I don't know if they're still um, in business or not. Most likely they probably are and they're manufacturing different type of masks. But this one here you cannot find, okay? And I'm going to guarantee you that because I try to find similar masks to mine. And I did manage to come across one on eBay. And they are titling it completely different than what it actually is. It is, in fact, a demon mask. They're passing it off as a, an old man scary mask. And here's the thing about that um, mask, okay? It's the exact same one you're seeing right now, okay? But they cut the damn hair on it. <laughs> it's got real short hair, okay? Apparently the guy didn't like the long hair thing, so he decided to cut it. And now he wants to get rid of it. And he's trying to get rid of it for like $27, which is not a bad price. But when you cut the hair, it is not the same, okay? It's just completely different when you cut the hair. It's most likely something happened to it, or he didn't like the looks of it, and he turned around and just snipped off the hair, <laughs> okay? It was funny, but it is the exact same mask, okay? I will tell you that. Anyway, I tried to look elsewhere for this particular mask, and I cannot find images or anything of this mask anywhere, with the exception of my uh, YouTube channel, where I actually posted it. But you won't actually see it if you do research unless you go into the channel and check it out. It won't show up in Google search because it's hidden in with the other masks and stuff. That's why I'm doing a separate video based on this particular mask. It is the Take One Demon Mask. Okay, I'm going to tell you that's what exactly what it is. Just so you get an idea of what it looks like. It's got an Iron Maiden Eddie feel about it. You look at it, it's like, oh, he looks like Eddie a little bit. And it does, okay, for the most part. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to shut this video down, pull off its stand, and then we're going to get a close look of this particular uh, mask, okay? So I will be right back. Alright, we're back guys. Now I wanted to show you this because this thing is absolutely huge. Okay, so I had to, um, I got to stuff it too, so I got to keep that in mind. But anyway, I wanted to show you what it looks like with all its hair intact. And it's not cut. It's extremely long hair, as you can see right here. Oh, get it over there. Let me turn this around so I can actually see what I ain't doing. Okay, I'm gonna pull back. And as you can see, it is a huge mask. Okay, it's one of the biggest ones I got. I do have a Frankenstein mask. It's probably a little bit bigger than this one, but this one's one of the biggest ones that I have. So what I'm gonna do is show you what it looks like up close. Okay, hang on. Yeah, pull that over. Okay. He is real teefy. Oh, get the angles right here. Okay. And that's what his mouth looks like. As you can see, he's pretty damn big. All the way to his ears. Okay. And obviously the other side too. Okay. But the hair in itself, I'm going to pull back so you can see, it's pretty lengthy. Okay. But uh, like I said uh, about that other guy, he actually has one of these, but he did in fact cut the hair on it. Why he did that, I don't know. I don't, you never know why people do what they do. But that is my demon mask. Now, the dimensions of this thing, I couldn't honestly say, but I'm thinking from the top of the head to the chin is roughly 15 inches. This mask is absolutely huge to where it has mesh eyes, okay? It is loose, and it's, like I said, it's got a very Iron Maiden look about it. And the actual inside of this mask, as I'm going to show you here, Okay, that's it's got like cushions in it, styrofoam. So it's very comfortable to wear. And I'm going to show you what it looks like here in a second. 
I will shut down the video so we can actually take a look at it. Okay, but that's what it looks like inside. It's got a very long chin. Okay, so what I'll do is I'll put the mask on so you can see what it looks like. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, this is what she looks like with the mask on. As you can see, it's huge. All the way, it literally goes past your neckline. Okay, that's how big this mask is. Okay. Okay. It's a little loose when you shake it, but if it feels very comfortable on the head because of the sponge that's in here. But there's not really much movement other than what you see me doing now. But it does fit comfortably. Okay. Well, that's it on this particular video. I hope you guys enjoyed this. And keep in mind, this is a one-of-a-kind, literally. Uh, because I haven't found anybody who has one of these. Or it's labeled different. I haven't come across one yet. But anyway, I'm going to end this here. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell. Because I will be pushing out some more videos. In the meantime, you guys have yourselves a good day. Looking at you, people.